Okay, next step is I'm going to want to take this cylinder and I'm going to apply just a little bit of motor oil in it. But really importantly is I'm going to swish this around. I'm going to take my finger and I'm going to make sure that there is oil all up and down this cylinder. I don't want anything to go together dry. Everything's got to be wet. So I got a nice coat of, oh, I use probably like a 30 weight or something like that. And then I'll slip this back into my jig. We're nice and tight. Now I'm going to take the piston. And I have already marked the top of the cylinder. So I'm going to find the number on the rod, number four, and I'm going to insert it gently down into the hole. And I'm going to take my ring compressor. Make sure that everything is nice and tight here. Okay. Now I'm going to tap on the ring compressor to make sure that I have as far down on the cylinder as possible. And then I'm just going to tap and we have a cylinder assembly. It's not rocket science. So, here's the test. I'm going to pull this out. I'm going to look for my number, number four. I'm going to look for the arrow. And I'm going to say at the top of the end, at the top of the cylinder, the arrow is facing forward. So when I put this on the left side of the engine, the number is, I'm sorry, the arrow is facing forward. And I got to do this six more times and they, we will have cylinder assemblies.